this season, we're facing a powerful enemy unlike any other. And we need new technologies to fight them. Our biggest breakthrough is the new tech tree for Chinese tanks. On tiers 7 and 8, both the BZ-58 and the BZ-166 are tough and speedy damage dealers with reliable armor. On Tier 9, the BZ-68 shows further advancement in speed and toughness, especially in its turret. At Tier 10, the BZ-75 comes out of the gate strong with very durable frontal armor. It has an easy time hitting targets with its main gun. Both the BZ-68 and the BZ-75 deal high damage per shot with their alternative guns at any pitch, which is good for playing the ridge. The performance of many Tier 9 vehicles has been tweaked. The T-55A now comes with an improved turret and hull armor and decreased reload time. It's now a collectible tank you can sell for 5,000 gold. The E-50 features an increase in rotation speed, along with an improved turret stock, top and hull armor, and a decreased reload time that compensates its higher shot dispersion radius. The Vickers Cruiser boasts increased health and a faster reload time at the cost of its turret armor. The Char Futur sports adaptive concealment mechanics and an improved circular vision radius. The KPZ-70, a better gun pitch. The Moishin, advantages in reload time and turret armor at the expense of its circular vision radius. The Conqueror, a faster reload time and an increased max speed. And the T-50 has decreased gun dispersion, aiming times, and a faster reload time for its autoloader. But it also takes a hit to its reverse speed, rear hull, and turret armor. You can learn about other improvements to a great number of Tier 9 vehicles in an article on the official site. Five tanks pose a new threat to the invaders in new visual quality, while two Chinese tanks come with cool camos. Among the maps, five favorites return as this season's battlegrounds. Winter Malinovka, Black Goldville, Dead Rail, Fort Despair, and Mayan Ruins, while five others get rotated out. Improved sounds of shots hitting targets in arcade and sniper mode will make the fight more well-rounded. Oh, and that was the new Ricochet. And when tending to your autoloaders, you can now see the maximum possible damage per minute. Let the invaders come. In Blitz's Season 3, we're ready.